All right, let's talk a little bit about these new polls we are yep. releasing right now at the second CNN ORC <laughs> polls. Hypothetical races choices for the presidency among registered voters nationwide. Look at this. If the contest were Mitt Romney versus Barack Obama, right now 48 Romney, 47 Obama, sampling error 3%. So that could be close, a tie. Uh, if it were, look at this, Mitt, uh, Barack Obama versus Ron Paul, also 48% for Obama, 46% for Paul, sampling error 3%. Those are pretty close races. Very close races. I mean, first of all, what this tells you, Wolf, is that no matter who's the nominee, this is probably going to be a very, very tight race, particularly if it's Mitt Romney. The eye-popping number to me, of course, was the Ron Paul number. And you remember 1992. This kind of reminds me a little bit of Ross Perot in 1992. Not likely to be the nominee of the party, but did really seriously affect the issues terrain that the candidates debated on. He's managed to take the deficit issue, which is important to all Republicans, and essentially turn it into a values issue of liberty versus sort of uncontrolled power in Washington that has a lot of resonance. But take a look very quickly of the other choices. You have uh, Newt Gingrich, for example, up against Barack Obama. He is nine points down, and he's making the electability argument, saying he's the most electable. And then you have Rick Santorum who's uh, very popular with evangelicals, and you see that uh, he is six points below Barack Obama. So that kind of affects them in the electability arena, wouldn't yeah. you say? Well, it's still yeah. pretty close all around. If I were the, uh, the Democrats exactly. and the president, i start worrying a, a little, lot. A little nervous. They got right. some stuff, no matter who the Republican nominee is going to be. 